Welcome to another video from Masunt. In this quick start video guide, we show you how to use online code allocation for the Masunt eCode models. The eCode key safes require neither a power connection nor a wireless or internet connection. To generate and send codes online, your safe must be registered once on the associated service portal. We will now explain how this works and how you can generate individual opening codes and send them online or by text message. To set up online code allocation for the first time, you need to follow a few simple steps. First of all, you need an account on the codelocksconnect.net service platform, which you will later use to register your key safe. Simply follow the instructions on the registration form on the website. All you need for your account is your email address. As soon as you have submitted the form, an email will be sent to you with an activation link, which you must click on to complete your registration. Once you have successfully registered, navigate to the CodeLocks platform homepage. Here you will find, among other things, information on safes you have created or current activities, such as opening codes you have already created. You will also find your credit account here, which you need to create new codes. To be able to test your new key safe extensively, you already have 20 free credit points to start with. If these are used up, you can easily book new credits in the Masunt online store. To add your safe, go to the Locks menu item and select the Add New Lock button. The portal also has the option of managing products from other brands. As a Masunt customer, we select the item for Masunt lock models accordingly and search for the appropriate key safe model in the next step. Your key safe must now be initialized. This means that the code calculation on the provider server and your local device are synchronized so that the safe can be opened later without an internet connection. To do this, you must first select the correct time zone. At this point, you will also find the master code. This always opens the safe regardless of the online codes created and is set to a default value at the factory. Attention, we recommend changing the master code only after the initialization of your safe and also keeping it safe. This means that you should definitely leave the preset code for the time being. If you have inadvertently changed the master code before initialization, please also use your newly selected code. If you now click on Generate Initialization Sequence, a sequence of numbers is displayed which you have to enter on the physical keyboard of your device. The colored dots symbolize the lighting of the blue LED on the device between the entries of the individual number blocks. To enter the sequence, you need the diamond symbol on the keyboard below the rotary lever. To be able to move this, you must enter the master code or, if already assigned, a user code and the safe. Now start entering the key on the key safe. If you make a mistake when entering the key, so that the red LED lights up, please wait 5 seconds before starting again with the complete entry. If you are successful, the blue LED flashes twice at the end. Confirm the entry in the online mask and enter useful additional information such as the name or location of your safe on the next screen. Please do not use vowel mutation or special characters. The description field is optional. Finally, check your entries and save them. Your key safe is now properly registered under your account. To create online codes now, select the Generate Netcode button and search for the safe you have just created from the device list. There are several online code types for different applications. These include, for example, time-limited codes for multiple use or codes for one-time use. Further information can be found directly in the info area of the selection field. Add the duration and the start time of the code validity and select Generate Netcode. Please note, codes can only be generated within the netcode type that was previously programmed in the lock. The netcode type standard is set at the factory. If you want to generate netcodes of the rental type, you must make the corresponding change directly on the device. Further information can be found in the instruction sheet. You can then use the created code for individual forwarding or send it directly by email or SMS to the desired contact details. Please note that the telephone number format must correspond to the format specifications of the input field. The content of the message field is customizable and already contains all the important information about the code for your guests, customers or employees. The safe can now be opened at the specified time with the created code. We hope our quick start guide has helped you and we are delighted that you have chosen a Masunt product. See you next time, your Masunt team.